Hi, it's Eddie Lawrence, the editor of the AJN, and we've just done a grueling hour of Broadway jazz here at The Space in Chapel Street. It has been hard work, but we have been put through our paces. Let's see how we go on. They told me I'd be joining a beginner's class. Beginners? No sooner had we begun than I thought I'd walked onto the set of a Madonna video. I'm not sure of the technical terms, but if our instructor Ian demonstrated all manner of fancy footwork and agile armwork, it seemed all my classmates could keep up. There they were, completing a Fosse-esque routine to the strains of Evita, and there I was, still trying to work out which was my left foot and which was my right foot. I'd like to plead advancing years as an excuse for my less-than-nimble performance, but truth be told, my prancing peers weren't exactly in their teens either. They were all ages and a range of sizes, proving that with a little bit of practice, anyone can get there. At least that's what Ian says. You know what, you don't need to be fit at all. What you do need is um, courage and some perseverance, I think. And do you need innate dancing ability, or is that something you can learn? No, not at all. So um, my feeling is you're always going to be uncomfortable the first couple of lessons. The more you come, the easier it gets. And if you hang with the same teacher, you'll get used to their style as well. For all my self-deprecation, there were three areas in which I did excel. Puffing, puffing and sweating. Quite aside from transforming myself into the next Fred Astaire, or to prove I'm down with the young folk, Justin Bieber Lake, this was what I believe is known in keep fit circles as a workout. Within a matter of minutes, the heart was pumping and the muscles were aching, sure signs that I was on the way to getting honed and toned. Crucially though, this was fun. For those who are tired of treadmills, bored of bikes and weary of weights, the dance class is a way to shape up and learn a whole new skill set at the same time. I'm not saying it'll turn you into John Travolta circa 1978 or a pussycat doll, but you'll certainly be the star attraction next time the band strikes up at a simcha. This is Teddy Lawrence, still trying to catch his breath, the space for JNTV.